What is up everyone? Welcome back to Steve's Corner and today I'll be showing you guys something really crazy in Minecraft that maybe some of you, but maybe not all of you know about. Uh, ignore this, I actually was just having fun breaking ice, but anyway, um, yeah, so today we're going to be looking at something called the Farlands and beyond the Farlands and everything today, and uh, basically, if you guys don't know what the Farlands are in Minecraft, well, um, I can't really explain them too, too well. I mean, I mean, I'm not really good at explaining things, but um, basically I can tell you right now though that the Farlands is like a chunk error uh, very far out into the world. So I'll tell you that, I'll tell you that, Um, but uh, yeah, sorry for repeating myself. I just, I don't know. Anyway, uh, so yeah, that's what the Farlands are. They're basically just, it's, it's basically just a chunk error and it's really cool. And uh, so a lot of you probably already know what the Farlands are as it is, but uh, Really, the reason I'm making this video, like, if I was just doing a video on just the Farlands, I probably wouldn't be making a video, but, um, really, the reason I'm making this video is because the Farlands and PS4 are more special, and, well, well, I don't want to say more special, but, like, different than the Farlands you would see on, like, mobile and PC and stuff. The Farlands and PS4 are quite different. Um, now, I don't know if this is the same thing with Xbox, or, or if it's just the same thing with all consoles, or what, but, um, all I can say is, on my PS4, on every PS4, it's not like, you know, the normal Farlands that you'd see in all these videos and stuff about the Farlands, um, it's really just something, it's quite different, so anyway, uh, enough talk, let's get into this, so, we're not gonna go directly to the Farlands, we're actually just gonna, uh, be going, like, farther and farther out into the world, and showing you what's, like, weird about these chunks of the world and stuff, that a lot, anyway, so, um, let's go to the coordinate 100,000, so, um, whoops, so, hold on, let me get my keyboard over here, um, TP, whoops, TP, I S, 100,000, 100, 100,000, now if you type this in, this is the first destination we're gonna go to, to show you something weird about this, so, when you're at this coordinate, um, yeah, I mean, a pretty average world, you'd say, you know, you're just walking around and stuff. But look at when I'm walking. You guys see, like, how it's, like, a little rough when I'm walking? Yeah, it's really weird. Uh, it's just a little rough when I'm walking, so it's already a little weird back here. So, yeah, guys, it's really just, I mean, I don't know. It's just, like, you know, after it gets far enough out into the world, it just starts getting a little bit weird. Like, when you're walking, you don't notice it too, too well. But, like, if you just look closely, you can see, like, I'm just glitching out a little bit. Like, I'm just going rough. But, um, yeah, that's pretty much, uh, it for this. I mean, there's not really much going on here other than just the rough, you know, texture when you're, like, walking. But, yeah, um, anyway, let's go to the next place. So, okay. Okay, guys, so, this is the next coordinate, and, um, we're going to 500,000 blocks out, and let's go ahead and check it out. Whoops. All right, um, all right, let's go check it out. Okay, so now we're here again. Um, okay, again, we're, you know, we're still on the same thing. We're not, it's not too much different than when we were at 100,000, but if we come here, we notice it's even more rough than 100,000. So, when you're, like, playing, like, in your world, you'll notice, you'll, it's easier to notice now than, you know, ever. So, it's, like, basically nothing too special again. It's just even rougher than at the coordinate of 100,000, so it's really just, I don't know, it's really just weird, but anyway, uh, yeah, there really isn't much to say about this one either, so let's get on to our next coordinates. Okay, guys, so this is our next coordinate to go to, uh, we're gonna go, like, a million blocks out, so let's go ahead and see what's there, so, of course, you guys have to use the same commands if you want to go to these places, obviously, okay, 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 first of all, first of all, um, now, okay, first of all, we're at a lot of water. Um, now, here is where it gets a little bit weird. It gets quite weird. So, um, basically, okay, so the first thing I gotta mention is, um, like, hold on. Okay, well, okay, this doesn't happen yet, but it gets, it gets quite weird here because it gets so much more laggier and laggier and laggier. It's just crazy. It is really, really crazy. I mean... Again, there's nothing too special here, but, um, it's just, it's just so staticky and, well, not really staticky, but, you know. Also, I want to show you guys something really cool, and I think, like, when you go, like, uh, corners, like, 
up to 100,000, that's when it starts happening. But I didn't mention it when we were there. So, look at when I place it. Wait, it's not... Okay, forget I even said that. Okay, I thought those torches would be, like, flat, because sometimes they are, but, okay, that might just be on, like, mobile and stuff. Anyway, um... So, I want to just keep this torch, because something really weird is going to happen at that in the future. So, uh, just keep waiting, and we'll be there. So, anyway, let's go get on to our next coordinate. Alright, guys, so anyway, this is the next coordinate that you have to go to. We're going to go 5 million blocks out, and let's see what's there. Okay, okay, let's see this. Alright, so when you go 5 million blocks out, um... This is basically, I mean, we're still in the, pretty much the same situation, except this time, you can barely move. Like, look, like, like, I mean, you can move, but it takes, like, a, it's hard to move. Like, if you're, like, in this rev world, you basically can't move. But if you're in creative and you, like, go fast or something, it, you, it takes a second for you to actually be able to move. And at this point, it is just crazy. Um, now... Yeah. Anyway, when you place the torches, now this is what I'm talking about. You, at this point, the torches are just flat. Hold on. Let me, like, try to give you guys a view. So, you can't even actually see the torches, to be honest. I mean, you could see, like, it, you know, the flame. You just can't see the actual torch, and it's really weird. Like, it has this tiny hitbox, if you guys can see a tiny line. But this is where the torches are, like, flat and weird, and that's what I was talking about when I was at the last corner, but I didn't see it. So, it's really, really weird. Anyway, um, so, by the way, just a quick heads up, uh, when I got, when I do these, uh, coordinates, like, when I say, like, 5 million, 100, 5 million, the last number doesn't have to be 5 million, that just means it applies to, like, both sides, or something, if you did, like, 5 million, 100, 1,000, the same thing would happen, it just happened on one side. I just want you guys to know that, like, you know. The Y coordinate would do it, and the X coordinate would not, or the X coordinate would do it, and the Y coordinate would not. It just depends on where you put the 5 million, but if you do both, it'll happen on both sides. So, anyway, let's get on to the next one, which will be, well, let's see. Okay, guys, so at the next coordinate, we're going to be at 10 million blocks out. So, um, basically, yes, let's press this. Okay, okay. Alright, so, okay, we're kind of in a bad place for this example. I kind of wanted to be online. But anyway, I do have to mention, at this point, you cannot move. I mean, well, you can move, but it delays even faster. Like, you have to wait, like, hold on, let me count. You have to wait, like, two seconds before you can actually end up moving. And, um, basically, you can also go through the blocks, as you guys can see. So, you, if you wanted to place a rival, it's impossible at this point, because watch. Like, like I said, like, if, you, if I'm going to go back down, I'm just going through the blocks, basically. So, the blocks are actually not even... Like, they're basically just air at this point. They're, like, nothing. Just air. And you guys notice, like, look at the particles. Like, the particles stay in one place because, like, the barrier, like, the slight barrier that delays the time you can fly and stuff, it, it's weird. So, like, let me even, sp I'm even going to spawn a mob for you guys. Um, so you guys can get an example of them falling without, like, me doing it. So, um, yeah. Okay, let's get, like, a... Uh, a pig. So watch when I spawn this pig. He just falls. I mean, there's no way to stay in this. Like, it just, you're just going to fall through the blocks at this point. Uh, so, yeah. So all these, like, that I'm doing right now applies to every version. But the next one will be the actual Farlands in Minecraft. And, uh, it's really weird because... At this point, like, the Farlands isn't really the same in PS4 or any console. I, I don't really know. As far as I know, it's just PS4. But it might be, like, Xbox and everything, too. But, yeah. Th it's just, it's not the same. The Farlands is not the same. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, let's get to the Farlands. I'm going to give you guys the coordinates right now. Okay, guys. Before I press enter for this one, like I said, Y and X, you know, coordinates are... Uh, you can do either one. It's still going to be the same thing. It's just a little bit different with... The corners and stuff, it's going to be the same thing in the corners, Y and X axis. So, I'm just doing this now. You guys don't have to type in exactly this, but it looks kind of, like, usually I just do this because, you know, why not? But anyway, um, let's enter. So, this is basically the far lens that we're supposed to be at. So, okay, so what is exactly wrong with this? Well, you guys can see for yourself, okay? So, when you get to this coordinate, um, this happens. So, exactly, like, at a certain point, it will be, like, 
the chunk of land just glitches out right here. And what do you know? There's a pillager outpost right there. Wow. So let's go check out this pillager outpost. You can see it's just going full in the ground and everything because it has nothing to stand on because after this it's all just water so now the pillager outpost is just going to be just sitting there now there is no pillagers in there obviously because i mean they went through the blocks because it's going to apply right here too like i mean honestly i could just go straight through this thing hold on let me show you i'll give you guys an example yeah i'm just going straight through it so anyway another cool thing i uh you guys will notice when you guys get here is if you look in the water you guys notice it's like all bedrock and stuff like there's no land here but like the structures and anything else but otherwise there is like no land but like ev any structures are there but like the land is not there so you guys um just so you know that's just gonna be so so like all that down there is bedrock basically now and that's what that is it goes always as deep as bedrock at this point it, it, i mean and honestly it's really cool like this is like a way that you guys can like hunt for fossils and stuff or whatever you want to do but i'd say you know you just gotta get a night vision potion so like me give you i'm sorry for giving you examples if you guys don't want it and you just want to check it out for yourself but i'm just gonna do it anyway let's see so all right we got like a night vision potion I'm just gonna get milk too because I don't want this to last forever. Alright, so once we get a night vision potion, we'll actually see. Alright. And as you guys can see, so yeah, basically this is all bedrock and stuff, and all the land is just cut out like that. I mean, I mean it's really cool, honestly, but it's not like something you're gonna be able to do in survival and stuff. Uh, anyway, yeah. So this is so what's so special about this compared to you know the one in uh pc and mobile and stuff well as you can see basically the ps4 and 4 one is different if you guys like understand the firelands and know what it looks like it's different because the land just cuts off here but usually if you guys were to you know the firelands usually would be like different like you'd see like these weird formations of like caves and everything you guys if you guys don't know what the firelands are go actually look up a picture of the firelands and you guys will actually see what the firelands look like like the actual you know firelands that everyone's used to uh because like usually like there'd be like this weird glitch going on in the world i, I don't even know how to explain it. it it's just really weird a really weird chunk error and if you guys do know the farlands and you don't really gotta go look at a picture but uh, this is just you know it, it just it's really weird like it looks even cooler than this i'm just showing you guys this because i mean i mean it's different it's not like the normal farlands we would think about every day like if we know what the farlands are we this isn't what we'd expect but in ps4 that's all there is to expect really because you don't really get the actual fire land. to get the actual firelands in ps4 like the one that the one that actually has all those chunk error crap in it you know uh, there's only one way which would be like if you go on mobile and then join the world from your ps4 and then teleport there that's like the only way but like if you generate a world in ps4 you're not going to get the you know all the weird errors and crap like yeah Oh crap, it's raining. Well, anyway, let's get on to the next coordinates, which is going to be beyond the Firelands. Uh, and there's nothing different about all this, but I'm just going to show you guys. So let's get on to the next one. Okay, guys, so for this next one, you guys may be wondering, um, why don't you have the... Okay, you know what? I accidentally mistake mistaken the Y-axis and the Z-axis together. Um, But yeah, anyway, if you guys are wondering... uh. Why aren't you making the z-axis, uh, axis, um, you know, the same number as the x? Well, the reason is because you guys will see. Okay, I'm not going to get you into that, but, uh, I am really sorry about, I, I really just mistaken the y and z-axis together. I, I mean, I'm used to, like, you know, actual coordinates, but, yeah, sorry. Anyway, about that, uh, so you guys can make the, um the third coordinate whatever you want and the second coordinate but i recommend like at least 100 or something i'd recommend um so anyway let's go there okay so when you're here this is what you're going to see okay what is going on here and what is the reason behind this well okay first of all what's going on here is well um yeah more chunk errors obviously but like what is this exactly what is the reason like i mean 
honestly. Well, really, okay, so first of all, this is called the stripe lens. At least I call it, and people, I'm pretty sure other people call it, but this is uh, known as the stripe lens, which is like beyond the far lens. But uh, let's go underwater and see what's actually really weird about this, too. Like, we can see all these lines and stuff, but there's something else other than just that. There's more to it. So when we go underwater deep enough, okay, so what do we notice about this? Look at this. The blocks are at this point just rectangular. They're rectangular blocks. They're not, they're like, they're like squished flatter blocks or like rectangular and their textures are just, I don't know, it's unbelievable. And another thing is it's like super dark underwater right here. And it's just, it's weird. It's just super dark under here. But uh, yeah, this looks really cool. I mean, and at this point you honestly cannot move at all other than like this way and this way but you cannot move the other way whatsoever like keep trying you're not moving you cannot move at all through the barrier look there's even a witch hut over there that's actually corrupted like it absolutely you cannot move this way at all like try to and see you will not be able to now i don't know if it'll take like a minute or two to actually do it and you can actually be able to do it but i mean like it's only going to let you stay in one place, and all the places that we can't get through, like right, those things, like the um, ones without water, I mean, there's not even water there, it's so glitched out, so I mean, I doubt you can even get past that, it's pretty much a barrier with nothing inside of it, either, I mean, honestly, so yeah, there's going to be structure, a little bit of structures here, too, uh, but there's, like, not, like, you know, like, all this land and trees and crap, so, um, Anyway, that's it for this part. Let's get on to the final coordinate. And this is that's not the, actually the end of the video because I'm going to show you guys something surprising in the nether end end. So anyway, let's get on to the next coordinate. Okay, guys, so this is the next coordinates now. It, now we're using the axe, both, uh, both of them. Uh, anyway, let's enter and see what we get. All right. All right, what do you got? Okay, first of all, we actually, you know what? Okay, actually there is biomes here, but most of it is just water, so. Okay, and most, there is biomes here actually. But, I mean, you don't, I mean, you you know what? Sorry if I'm sounding a little weird, but you know what? Um, the Actually, there is biomes here, but there's not like normal grass lands here. That's, that's what I'm noticing. Like, there is biomes, but there's like not normal grass plains. Um, okay. But we do get an interesting view of the um, a biome right here and what it looks like. And this is an example of an ice biome, uh, ice spikes. Um, and basically, it's doing the same thing. Like, we just got squares now. Now, I kind of sound like I repeated myself, but trust me, I didn't. So, now we have squares and, uh, well, not oval i mean um rectangles my brain is going cuckoo today well technically we have squares but there is still rectangles on the side of the blocks so like we we're breaking land right now but like you know there's no visible land you know that's the weird thing about it there's no actual visible land like it's really weird like there's water there was land it looked like but there's no visible land and another weird thing i noticed is like the lava like you know there is like water touching it but it's just not turning into obsidian like not all of it's turning into obsidian it's weird anyway so that's basically it for like you know the world you the farthest out you can go is 30 million blocks but it looks just the same there's you know no point in looking i'm just saying you can't go farther than that or uh, you can but it takes like a app and mod for like um phone and stuff like where you can go like over two billion blocks i don't know but i'm not gonna review that because i'm doing stuff for ps4 and all that so um anyway let's get into the nether farlands okay guys so now we do have our nether portal here but i just wanted to mention something really weird so i was building my nether world on those like survival islands area and like look at this tiny tiny ravine <laughs> it's really tiny i mean i know why it's tiny because you know there's water here so it's cutting off but a ravine on a tiny survival island that's just funny anyway um ignore that that's not part of this video and why would it be because it's just a tiny ravine but whatever anyway um let's get into the nether Okay, so we're in the nether now. Uh, so we're not gonna look at like every single coordinate again, like the stripe lands and stuff. We're just looking at the far lands. So um, let's get 
to the coordinates. So again, we know the coordinates. Um, if it's the same coordinates, basically. So um, you know, and yep, yeah, same coordinates. All right. So here we're actually wait, wait hold on. We're actually high up in there. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh crap. Whoops. Oh, okay, okay, hold on, we're here, we're here. So okay, here's the thing. The nether and the end farlands are way weird. Like I don't even know. Like these this is like the weird formations so um if we go to the farlands basically the farlands would be here like one wall of the farlands and the other would be like right here or something i think uh so yeah like like the other farlands the thing it does cut off basically but we do see something that is pretty trippy so if we go here this is what we're seeing um it honestly i don't even know what to say i mean it's really just a weird formation of just layers of just I don't know layers and rows of blocks and they go out as far as the farlands does and there it's just it's a little weird like it's just a weird chunk error of course but it's just it, it's not like the overworld you know like this isn't something we've seen in the overworld so as uh so guys if you guys are asking why isn't this in the overworld honestly I have no idea but another thing I notice is I don't is this normal for this to happen like the particles are they going? Is it? Are they supposed to be going up and down? I can't tell. What? Something looks off about this. Okay, I don't know. Anyway, but yeah, why doesn't? Why isn't this happening in the? Happen in the overworld like this form? Honestly, I cannot answer your question. I, you know, that's actually something I want to know myself. But I really don't know why this doesn't happen in the overworld. But it happens in another and the end, which we're, I'm going to show you in a second. That actually looks a little more crazier in the end i honestly have no idea why this cannot form in the overworld um but again if you're on like mobile and a uh, pc or something you would see like the weird looking structures out here and stuff you would see the weird chunk glitch stuff out here and you know and you'd also actually see this too you'd also see this but just in between both of the farlands things like the things but yeah that's you know this is weird so anyway let's get back to some normal coordinates so i can build an end portal or i could just probably build it here anyway i'll see you guys when i have the end portal built anyway guys look at this look at this i'm building the end portal in the farlands why are the literally why are the uh dude you you can already tell me what's off about this the eyes of ender they're humongous okay um yeah that's a weird looking end portal i don't know why why are the eyes of ender so big i have no idea when i throw them though i can't even actually i literally can't even throw them okay well let's go into this end portal wait did it not take us uh okay apparently we can't go in the end right here wait does the farlands form inside the end dimension thingy right here i don't know okay guys i'm not going to stall i'm just going to go back to normal area and we're going to go check out the farlands in the end if you guys on this is literally i'm describing so many things when we're doing this oh my gosh I, I don't know why I said, oh my gosh. I meant, oh my gosh. But anyway, uh, yeah, I'm going to get back to some normal coordinates because this is not usual. Okay. Um, oops. All right. Yeah, uh, like, why would the end pearl, ender pearls be like that? Like, not the ender pearls, eyes of ender. Okay, I'm just going to go some, to some coordinates like this and we'll be back in the nether, in the normal nether. Hopefully not inside the blocks. And of course we are, of course we're inside blocks. Okay, no, no, we're not, no, we're not. Okay, uh, all right, so hopefully the end portal looks normal this time, and it actually works normal. Let's do it. Dude, that was weird. I didn't even know that, but, like, the ender, the eyes of ender, like, were corrupted. 
Okay, so they're obviously on the wall now. Alright, so we're in the end, as you guys can see. Uh, anyway, let's get to our coordinates for the Farlands. So anyway, let's do this. Alright, because I'm done stalling. So anyway, TP at S um one two five five zero eight zero zero um one hundred one two five five zero eight zero zero so okay so um here it is it, it's basically like the nether except it's actually quite a bit more trippy like when we're moving like watch this like tell me it's not trippy like watch like look it's just a little trippy like if you just look in the corners and stuff it's really trippy and again as every other structure the far lands would come right here but in the ps4 it doesn't do that so um yeah it, it this is just you know insane uh honestly i don't know how what to say i, I really don't know what to say it, this is trippy and it's really cool so anyway uh that's the end of this video guys sorry for like an, a lot of errors and what i was saying oh what the what what's happening when i'm looking up and down and uh first person look what's happening whoa okay guys i don't know what's going on but if you come out this far in your world yeah you're probably going to discover a lot of new things that i probably don't even know about what like what is going on why is this happening i'm just trying to do my outro and this is happening guys i'm actually learning new things myself while i'm trying to make this video but anyway uh i hope you guys enjoyed the video please give it a like and subscribe if you guys just want to see some more minecraft videos please give this one a like and i'm just going to see what happens if we place an another end portal in the end farlands they're probably going to do that one thing that we just saw in the nether with the ender pearls actually you know who cares if i place it oh. yep so this i don't know why but i will tell you um that when you're uh is it like literally bigger than the actual like i don't know um but anyway yeah this happens you can't go through apparently you guys can't not go through the end or anything like this far out i mean i don't know why but you know anyway i hope you guys enjoyed the video please go and subscribe and i'll see you guys with another video um and for the last thing, throwing it under, uh, I have, no, oh my gosh, I'm getting my stuff mixed up. Throwing it under Pearl out in the Farlands, and it literally glitches out. Honestly, I don't even know how it's working. If you go, would go three, I don't know how it's even working, but whatever. That's crazy. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please go like and subscribe. I'm just going to say, I'm just saying this one more time. But yeah, a lot of glitches here. If I find any more, I might review these glitches in the Farland, Farlands and stuff. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please go like and subscribe.